Hollywood and Highland Center here in the heart of Hollywood. I'm so glad to be sitting here with the beautiful, the uber talented Delaney. How are you doing today, Delaney? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm pretty good. We're so excited. Thank you for being our first ever artist that we're launching with Tectonic Pop. We're really excited to be exploring your music and what you're all about. I have the first question, so I'm going to hop right into the interview, guys. But Delaney, I would like to know, if you could describe your music in one word to the world, what would it be and why? Fuck. Because I don't want anybody to take music too seriously. It's all about letting yourself loose and having fun and really just hanging out with your friends and, and feeling the music, you know? Definitely get that vibe. Really upbeat, too. Yes. <laughs> and I don't want anything that's like depressing. Right. Yeah. I mean, some love songs are good, but depressing <laughs> music is just like, you know. Okay, yeah, so tell us, we know you write your own songs, and do you like writing your own songs? And what is the process for coming up with new material? Well, the process for coming up with new material, and you know, you basically, it takes time, like you have to write. Um, first you have to build a story, then with that story you have to build, you know, lyrics of course that are going to match that story. But I definitely like writing my own music, just because it, I, it comes from the heart, especially the love songs. And, you know, things in the past that have gone down, it, it's kind of... Yeah, you kind of relate to it more. And the fun music is, is what really the fans can connect with because, <laughs> <laughs> because you know, it's just more upbeat and it's more fun and, and people always want to just let loose and be themselves. Yeah. So I have a little confession to make. I actually found out about Delaney um, researching a little YouTube channel called Arc Music. Now you guys may know Arc from Rebecca Black's Friday. Now that I kind of got a little bit of flack for being kind of like the most disliked YouTube video in YouTube history. But after peeping out her music, I have grown to love her because she's so much fun. She represents pop music. She can dance, she can sing, she has the look, she has an image. So Delaney, I want to ask you, what was it like working with Patrice? Like, I know a lot of people in the media have been giving him flack, saying that he just, you know, produces like these one hit wonders and that kind of stuff. But seeing your music, I really enjoy it. And I'm, it reads that you enjoyed working with him. So Thank how did you. it feel? Um, Patrice is, well, first of all, Patrice is a great guy, and I think people need to cut him some slack because, for one, he's a genius, and two, he can produce the heck out of any video, so if you're an artist out there looking for a video, definitely go with Patrice Wilson, and don't believe everything that you hear. You know, um, Rebecca Black made it, and, you know, it's, it, whether it's with a stupid song or, or you know, it's, it doesn't matter, you know, right. <laughs> he's still a genius for doing that. And, um, you know, it's just like, Patrice is a great guy to work with. He's really, you know, loving and he, he cares a lot about the artists that he works with. Because that's something I noticed, the quality of the video that you produce with him, um, Poppin', by the way, is what I'm referring to, it was so, like, I was like, oh, she's getting it. She has a dance routine, she has the solo point part, so I'm like, it was, you know, very good, so. Right. Well, he, the team, too, uh, the whole thing with Patrice is like his team that he has around him and the people working with him are so good okay. and so talented. And it, it's it's for the work that the artist puts in for it right. as well. You know what I'm saying? You can't just expect to be great and go and say, you know, produce my video. Right. Yeah. you got, you got to put that in. Because you wrote that song, right? Uh, yeah, I wrote okay. yeah. with um, Raphael Hamilton. That's okay. our craft. And um, he's really great. He did the beat and then I wrote the um, actual... Yeah. 2013 is going to be a big year for the Hollywood artists for pop music, especially dance pop. Well, do you have anything planned? Tours, albums? Of course. <laughs> um, actually, I got a lot going on. I just released my new single, Really Wanna, that was produced by Aaron Reed. Guys, Aaron Reed is L.A. Reed's son. <laughs> X Factor, you guys all know L.A. Reed, so I'm pretty sure this song is going to be so fly. If you haven't heard it, she's going to give you all the links and stuff later on in the video. Right. And um, it's actually on iTunes now. And um, I'm going to be doing a video with John Constantine. And he's actually a producer for Lifetime Television Network. And he's great. He just came out with this film called In the Dark. So if you guys haven't seen it, you should totally check it out. And um, yeah, so that's, that's what's going on right now. We're working on a tour. And I'm in the process of recording my new album. Because my past album was It's Going Down. Then I released Really Wanna. And then now I'm working on new music. And hopefully you guys will hear me on the radio soon. Uh, and um, I we're can gonna be promoting so much. So. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I 
Oh, and then plus you're going to see some choreography from this. Oh my goodness. <laughs> well then, I just got really excited, guys. But you were also telling me that you're coming out with maybe a reality show or something like that. Right, okay. yes. I'm coming out with a reality TV show and we're actually working with Authentic Television Network. And I can't say too much about it, but it has gotten picked up and I think it'll be airing in August. Guys, you heard that. Yeah. Exclusively from her right now, August 2013. Be on the lookout for this reality show. We're so excited. We'll post it on our website and everything. Right. So. Yeah. That was really exciting. I just got to, I don't know why I'm so excited. But anyway, okay. So let's move on. Like you mentioned before, you like having fun with dance pop music. Right. Um, but after doing a lot of research on your music, I noticed that you like to do a lot of cover ba of ballads. Slower songs, she did a cover to Adele, Someone Like You, um, Talking to the Moon by Bruno Mars. So she really, really likes to channel that um, route of the slower mid-tempo ballad types. So I want to know, do you prefer doing more of the party music where everyone can kind of jam to and have fun? Or do you like to express your creativity more with writing the slower mid-tempo ballad songs? As confusing as this is going to sound, both, okay. <laughs> because you you can get an aspect to where to where your fans and people around you can connect to, to can jam out to your music right. if it's fast and it's poppy or hip hop ish and right. you know you got fun music. But then you if somebody's going through a hard time in their life or a bad breakup or relationships or whatnot, then I, I kind of like to get into the slower ballads and right. see for me I was going through a hard time myself so someone like you and talking to the moon okay. totally expressed me at that moment. And what was the other song? Um, Arms Wide Open I believe? Yes, yes. I, I wrote that song okay. when I was going through a difficult time. Yeah, we watched the video and we were like, oh my gosh, <laughs> I, I can totally relate to it. So. <laughs> um, but yeah, you know, just certain different songs are for different reasons, different stories. Um, so everything has its purpose, every song has a purpose and a meaning to it. So I really don't have a favorite, like, love or ballad or, or hip-hop-ish upbeat. I kind of, they're both of So you released really Moana, tell us what was the process for coming up with that and why do you connect with it? Well, really want is such like a beat song and it's like, it's kind of like telling a guy like, you know, you, or girl, it could vice versa, whatever. A guy can be telling a girl, a girl can be telling a guy. It's like, do you really want to, like, do you really want to go there, like, as far as a relationship with me, or do you really want to hold my hand or be my friend, dance with me, but then you're kind of like, I see you looking at me, you know? Like, I know, I know you want to That is so here. relatable, guys. It, <laughs> and the song's just about, like, do you really want to, you know? And it, it was fun because it's not a too serious song. Like, I don't think people should take, like I said, I don't think people should just take music right. so serious like that, you know? It was just like a fun song, and it's very upbeat. I showed a little bit of my rapping skills, and I... Y'all also have to be about her rapping on So Fly, because <laughs> I can probably recite all the lyrics right now, but I'm not going to embarrass myself, because she clearly is better than me. Oh, no, I want to hear it for the... Oh, no! Okay, okay maybe. We'll we're see. We're going to hear it. <laughs> But yeah, so definitely really one of was fun recording and working with Aaron Reed was really great. And by the time I got there to Atlanta, um, the whole song, of course, was already pre-written and he already knew how he wanted it to go. And so when I got in there, I was like, okay. And actually the rapping part was the singing part. And I was like, you know what? See, this whole song, thing. this whole song singing, let's add some rapping to it. Uh -huh. And so when we did that, it was just kind of like, yes, <laughs> yes, we're going to do that right now. So yeah, that was just how really what it was. So. Well, I'm so looking forward to listening to it. Like I said, I'm going to be posting the link to purchase that on iTunes below in the description box. But right now, guys, we're going to kind of wrap up the questionnaire part of the interview, and we're going to have a little fun. <laughs> I created a little game called the Five Second Name Game. And basically, Delaney, we're going to name off just random things. It could be a celebrity. It could be food. It could be anything. You have five seconds. We're going to put a, a timer on the bottom of the screen. She has five seconds to say the first thing that pops to her mind. Now, we want you to be outrageous, fun, be yourself. But the one thing we want you to be is honest. honest. Don't just say, you know, some cookie cutter answer. Just the first thing that pops, pops to your mind. Anything in my mind at all. Anything in your mind. Just say it. So are you ready to play the five second I'm interview? I'm ready. Are you guys ready? I'm ready. All right. So here we go. The Kardashians. Big booty. <laughs> Alright, um, Texas. Um, um, Sorry. you don't know, you know what I was saying. Big hair, big hair. <laughs> big hair. Alright, that's cool. Um, celebrity crush. Eric Dane. Ooh. Yeah. Happy, very. Oh, yeah, I don't 
Did y'all? I'm gonna put a little picture like right here for you guys stuff. to see. <laughs> she has some good taste. All right, let me let me move on. In and Out Burger. Oh yeah, they're cheese fries. Just the animal about. cheese fries. That's like, a secret menu. So if you guys didn't know, we, go to there. We were just talking fries. about like everywhere here in California always has like chili cheese fries and like all these loaded fries. We, I'm from Florida, so we don't have that back home. But yeah. we went there like two weeks ago. I'm gonna go keep it out. Well, I'm really upset because here they don't have a water burger, but in Texas they have a water burger. Uh, see, I drove through there, but I didn't really like. <laughs> Let's stop talking about food. Next thing. Next thing. Boy bands. Ew. Um, I'd have to say the Beatles. But if we're talking oh, current, probably. Be best friends, guys. <laughs> <laughs> if we're talking current, though, um, I'd have to say. <laughs> one Republic. Ooh. And I was actually in just one of their videos. Oh really? What video? Um, if I lose myself tonight, check it out. Check that video check out, guys. Out. I, I messed with Eddie's the drummer's hair, Eddie okay. Fisher's hair. So hopefully they put that clip in there. But if they don't, you'll still see me headbanging in that video. That's awesome. so. Um, Erin Carter. I want candy. <laughs> she took it way back. For those of you newer viewers, you, you know, teenagers, didn't know before Justin Bieber, it was Erin Carter. Carter. So, like, he was... And then it was Jesse McCartney. Yeah! <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, so our last, our last one is going to be your fans. I love them so much. Team Lano. And, um, yeah, they're just so great. And if I, it wasn't for you guys, I would be nowhere right now. I would probably have never met these two because my Twitter wouldn't have been popping for you guys to even have seen. You hear that? Popping. Popping. That's the jam, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> well, we're getting to the end of the interview now that the game is over. So tell your fans, tell our viewers where they can reach you, whether it's Twitter or Facebook. Okay, cool. Um, you guys can reach me at www.delaney.com and um, they'll probably put the links below and twitter.com forward slash Delaney Brown and facebook.com forward slash Delaney Official. So you guys should connect with me on my social sites and I usually reply to as many people as I can so feel free to send me messages, at mentions, whatever and check out the new website for sure because we just revamped it and all my new photos and music are being put on there so go check it out. Yes guys, <laughs> so out. like she said, we're going to be posting everything in the description box below so make sure you just click show more and we're going to have all her links to find everything about her. Delaney, thank you so much thank for taking you. the time out to sit with us. It was an ultimate pleasure. You were so much fun. I was, I'm just, <laughs> I'm in love with you. Um, but with that being said, I'm Jeremiah. And I'm Monica. And, and I'm you, Delaney. Oh, yes, she's Delaney, guys. And you guys are watching Tectonic Pop TV. Make sure you subscribe. Check out her music. She's amazing. Love you. Hugs. Love you. Yay. <laughs>